It's Warriors Anonymous Next Gen bringing you the penultimate game of the Warriors Jersey Flag Cup season as they were at home to take on the Bulldogs over at Go Media Stadium. How did they get on? Well, you're going to want to have a look at this one. All the highlights, thanks to New South Wales Rugby League TV. And in the eighth minute, the Bulldogs with a bit of attack to the left, and out it would come to Logan Spinks, and he would dive over with the first try of the game. Nice shift here out to the left from the Bulldogs. Of course, Logan Spinks, not to be confused with former boxer Leon Spinks. Look at this, just throws a little sort of half dummy, I guess, and goes straight over there to get the scoring underway. Now, three minutes later, Doggies, they would attack from their own half. Great in ball. This is Callum Donaldson. Gets the ball on the outside to the centre. William Afualo. And he has too much pace going over to score to extend the Bulldogs' lead. Let's have a look at this one again. Nice ball back on the inside. And Callum Donaldson, another one of the promising young players in the Bulldogs system. Got it out to the centre. Afualo. Just too much speed there for the fullback. And they go out to a 10-0 lead. More attack, knocking right at the door. That is the prop forward, Larry Mwangu Tutsia. Pretty straightforward stuff, really. Out of dummy half. And the ball came up to Big Larry. Knock, knock. He goes straight in to extend the lead to 16-0. Warriors, they would get something. A little something going before half time. None of the Tafovake here. Just barrels in. Straight out of dummy half. To get them on the scoreboard, it was 16-6 at half time. And the Warriors would come back seven minutes after the break with a nice short ball. Oh, look at that. It is delicious. The money ball. Coming from the number six, Maui Winitana Patele Seal. And it was beautifully run onto there by the number 14, Alvin Chong Ni, playing out in the centres in this game. Now, into the 51st minute. Now, have a look at this. Everything stops for just a moment. And then all of a sudden, nope, we're back on again. Ituate Fuka Fuka gets the ball outside. Good support from Namborisi, the fullback. And he gave it away to Vake. Nana to Tafo Vake. He barged over before from dummy half, and this time had too much speed for the cover defense. Look at this again. You might have seen the Statue of Liberty play in the NFL. And this was kind of like that. Just stopped, and yep, up, oh, we're on again. Fuka Fuka tricked them all. Got the ball on the outside, and well supported there by Ratu Namborisi. Gave it away to Vake. And look at the speed on the outside. Fullback coming across. No show. Celebrates before he gets the ball down. Nearly got himself into problems there. But all good. Warriors, they're on a roll here. And as they would be a few minutes later as well, Harry Durbin. He goes knock knock straight at the door. Nice dummy run there from Rodney Tuipolotuvert on the inside. Warriors taking the lead now. Look at this, 63rd minute. Kick would come up. From Munitana Patele Seal and a good chase here. And it was Rafael Seal who got up. Rafael Seal later jumped up over the fullback, dots it down. Let's have a look at it on the WA replay. Perfectly placed kick there. A really good chase. They applied the pressure. And Seal just went up as the Bulldogs are falling over themselves. Four minutes later, another shift out to the left this time. Great ball from Namborisi. And he got it out to the number four, Gary Tui Lekotu. And scoring another try, as he has done for a lot of the season as well. Let's have a look on the slow-mo replay. Winitana Patele Seal, great ball out. Layman shifted it beautifully. Quick hands all around. And then just a bit too much speed again. Created the angle. Dui Le Kutu. Got on the outside and then just knifed back in. To seal the Warriors win. What a good win this was. 32 points to 16. Six tries to three over the second place Bulldogs. It's a big scalp to take. Especially this late in the season. Warriors down in 11th spot on the table. And they knock off one of the big guns. Good stuff, boys. Now one more game left in the season for the Warriors jersey flag side. They're going to be travelling over to Cronulla to take on the Sharks at Points Bet Stadium on Saturday. So that's going to be immediately before the NRL side take on the Sharkies as well. And then it's going to be at 5.20pm kickoff New Zealand time. No live stream for that one. But rest assured, we will have you covered right here on Warriors Anonymous Next Gen. Bring you all the good stuff. Hopefully another rousing win. Wouldn't that be cool to finish off the year a real high? We'll catch you then for that one. At the Waz, go the Warriors!